Hey, welcome to Sports Circle 345. As I always say, this is a place where we discuss track and field in its entirety. Before we go any further, I want to say, if you have not subscribed to the channel, please hit the subscribe button down below. You will be assisting, you will be helping the channel a lot. I took a break from the sporting arena and I'm back to share the illustrious events with you. Now, there was something that took place recently in Paris 2024 Olympics. The World Athletics Council has approved an innovation to the regular competition format for the Paris 2024 Olympic Games, introducing a repertoire around all individual track events from 200 meters to the 1500 meters in distance, including the hurdles. In the new repertoire format, Athletes who do not qualify by place in round one heat will have a second chance to qualify for the semi-finals by participating in the repertoire heat. This will replace the former system of athletes advancing through fastest times in addition to the top placings in the first round qualifiers. These events will now have four rounds, round one, repertoire round, semi-finals and the finals. This schedule varying according to specific nature of the event. The new format means that every athlete competing in the event with a repertoire round will have at least two races in the Olympic Games. As the 100 meter already has been eats before round one, the repertoire will not be in this event. In addition, the repertoire will not be introduced in distance event as the need for proper recovery between rounds makes the format impractical. World Athletics President Sebastian Coe said, after consulting with our athletes and broadcasters, we believe this is an innovation which will make progression in these events more straightforward for athletes and will build anticipation for fans and broadcasters. The Repertoire's round will give more exposure to our sport during the peak Olympic period and will be careful scheduled to ensure that every event in our Olympic program retains its share of spotlight. The final regulation of the format introducing the timetable as well as system of advancement in each event will be announced well in advance of the Olympic Games. Now, with all being said, some people are in support of it and some people are not. One such person that is in support of it is Michael Johnson. Please take a little bit of time and read what he says. This is very interesting and we will just have to wait and see how this will turn out at the 2024 Olympics. We know we might have faster times as well as we might not see certain faces at the Olympics that we used to see. However, we have to just wait until Olympic time comes around in 2024. Thank you very much for watching and please remember on your way out, please subscribe to the channel. Peace out. God bless you. Thank you very much.